what is this? Like, what? What is that? Well, nobody wants to watch it not blurry either, so it's fine. What's that image six? Probably should have checked all this before hitting start stream, but I didn't, so we're just gonna go with that. All right, um, let's check and see if we, if it looks like we're streaming or not. Let's move that over. Um, mm -hmm. We're gonna get this set up for a second. I wanted to stream real quick before we do our team meeting and because this really nutball board just showed up that has practically nothing on VCC main. So we're gonna, we're gonna just play with it and see what we can do with that. It's here for data recovery and we'll see what we can do. All right. Okay, it looks like at least one of these is working. I don't know about Twitch. Perfect timing. I needed leg day entertainment. Michael Overdick sounds like he's at the gym. I went to physical therapy today. Like in, that's the that's the next step up from having to go to the old people uh, uh, fitness class. I went to the old people fitness class because my back's been hurting for about six weeks. Yeah, um, you get a massage. I yeah, I totally 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 need to do that. Yeah, uh, so so that that. That uh, old people, old people fitness class was kind of lame. Sitting there rowing to the dock of the bay, sitting on the dock of the bay, that was lame. The only thing lamer than that is going actually going to physical therapy, which was totally awesome. I mean, the guy like diagnosed poor ankle mobility as part of back pain. Yeah, who knew? Who saw that one coming? Not me. So, uh, but he did say yes. I will deadlift 300 pounds again. Yay! So. Yeah, he told me I was going to scratch my way, claw my way back up to the, awesome. uh, to, to work it. Okay, why is there a ghost of Pepe the Frog on the image? Mm, is that what he did? Did he put a filter on there? Let's delete that. Image six. Yeah, that's totally Lewis. Oh, fuck. I know, I, I should have been suspicious. It looked like he came back in and changed my desktop background to black, which I thought was a nice thing. That's why he wanted to know when I was streaming today. Fucker. Let's delete this because he's streaming, so he will not get to see that. There. Much better. What else did he do in here? Uh, so he must have killed the focus then. I don't know how he could have done that, but I'll blame him anyway because that's this camera is from Rossman uh, Supply, so Mail and Repair sent me this camera. That's what it looks like. So that's what you're gonna get if you go with those guys. Um, let's look under the microscope. No shit, there's a Pepe there. Yeah, there was. Let's see if he's on all the other scenes now, fucker. God damn, that fucker can fucking troll. I'll tell you that. Look, well, did you, did you see my desktop yesterday? Yes, I did. Yeah, I didn't do that. <laughs> I didn't, I don't know if you, I don't know if you noticed, but I, Jessa, did not put <laughs> Donald Trump Pepe in a Make America Great Again coffee really? mug. I thought that was pretty That's horrible. horrible. That's terrible, isn't it? That's that just is, such yes. a shame. Yes. It was funny. Exactly. Like, what the frick is she doing now? I don't know. So let's go ahead and look at this. Wow. That's um, pretty funny. Though. So this is here for data recovery. And it seems to have a short on VCC main. First, let's look under the microscope and let's get rid of fucking Pepe. Oh, I see. He's just in the corner. God, what a fucking him? troll. Look at that. Oh, How he like, he like, fucker. Uh, what a fucking fucker. God damn. How are you going to get rid of him? I'm going to delete the shit out of Pepe. I'm going to step on him. All right. Here we go. Let's look at this board. All right, let's look at this iPhone 6. So it's it's missing a few things. I don't know if they're important or not. Let's just kind of take a little take a little tour. What's wrong with yours, Jean? Nothing. I'm still looking for a good press of Oh, well, that one wasn't good. No. So we're missing the Wi-Fi chip. So it's uh, not going to have Wi-Fi. Um, little pad damage there. Uh, VCC main short here. C52 is missing, and so are all of its uh, little kids. Let's go ahead and use the multimeter and um, check on a VCC main short. So we'll go... Are you fucking kidding me? What does that mean, Gene? Well, I just 
just took out one that I haven't used and I put it right next to the one I already did. Oh, God, and you put the same one back in? Been one. there, done that. That, that really, is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Every, I think everybody's done that before. Welcome to the club. Lewis says, I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course he does. I'm sure it was Sharon. Sharon. You know me. I'm a whiz. <laughs> Sharon is, uh, yeah, you know, it's definitely Sharon who's right over there. Obviously the most, you know, she's far more technically savvy than Lewis Rossman. I hide it well. Yeah. She hides it well, yeah. So it's part of her underground kind of secret. So, so she can do things like this. No one would ever, would ever, would ever suspect her. Ever. Okay, so ever, like ever, ever. That's right. Uh, we were talking about one of Sharon's other hidden skills. Uh, Sharon can run a jackhammer, which I didn't know, uh, which is great because Gene needs to get a sump pump put in. So I think it'd be fun to go over there and stream that. Bunch of, bunch of chicks take on a jackhammer and put in a sump pump. I think we could do it. I think we could, of course we could do it. How hard can it be? How hard can, why do we need to pay some man to run a jackhammer. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. I'm sure it's fine, easy. All right, so there's no audio I see. There is, these are VCC main caps. They're not there. We're missing two VCC main caps there. We're missing a VCC main cap there and there. We're missing the uh, like Oscar accelerometer chip. We're missing the power management chip. We're missing a shit ton of caps around here. And it looks like they've been mostly pulled off with my favorite method, which is rip them off the board. So good job on whoever, whoever got that started. Missing baseband uh, power uh, IC. Uh, we've got some corrosion there, but they're not on VCC main. We're missing this cap here on VCC main. We're missing the little Q1403. We're missing Tigris. And we got most of the bottom of the board. Oh, we're missing that guy. We're missing these two dudes. Uh, which, oh, we got a piece of solder right here. Nice. Let's flip it. We've got a dock. We got a battery connector. Things are looking up. We're missing, uh, oh, that looks kind of bad. Uh, we're missing a bunch of VCC main stuff that lives around here in baseband area. We ha we're missing backlight driver. We're missing these two caps. We are missing chestnut. Wow. We're missing Mesa chip. And, oh, we're missing the camera LDO. We're missing the cap that goes next to him. And we've got some fucked up shit on the connector. And we've got a bunch of shit over here. So where'd you get this board? I found it on the street. Cars are running over it. <laughs> now this board is here for data recovery. We're going to get the data off of this. In theory, at least. All right, so... Um, Somebody, who are those uh, looks, looks a lot like a board I'd send in, says Paul Daniels. I see a lot of Pepe on my, uh, on my, uh, on my, my Twitch here. Uh, I would, I would make, uh, high, high 217 a mod if he would take off his Pepe, but I don't really know how to do that. So actually, I wonder if I could, if I went over to Twitch. All right, so let's at least start by making sure that, that we don't have an obvious problem here because that's clearly bridged. So Sharon, what do you think is wrong with this board? It got run over. <laughs> it got run over. <laughs> um, yeah, it looks, it looks like it did. It looks like it, it kind of met, met up with a jackhammer. That's what it looks like to me. All right, let's put this on iron and... Lewis video is basically all Pepe talk currently. Oh, I'm sure it is. Yeah. As it always is. Every day. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Lewis loves him some Pepe. All right. Okay, let's let's just kind of get get some of that. I need an I need another piece of braid. My braid is at the on its very very last leg. Very last leg. I don't even know if I can fit it in there. Really should go grab the thin braid. But I'm not going to. Who are we kidding? As long as nobody's touching anybody, then we're good. All right, nobody's touching anybody, so that's good for measuring. Let's see if that happened to clear our VCC main short. So we'll just go back and measure it at sort of the classic spot. 
All right, come on, VCC main. And it's still short. So this one, it's really hard to imagine why it is that this board still has a VCC main short. And I can see why it would be uh, something that somebody has really put a lot of time into and really been beating their head on. So let's see if we can figure it out. So what we'll have to do is go over to ZXW and just compare to see is there is there any VCC main left on this board? Because I'm thinking the answer might be really close to um, hell no. But let's let's find out. All right, I will Pepe the fuck out of Twitch chat. Okay, um, came over here. Lewis, Justin, Pepe, denial mode. Well, I have deleted Pepe. Let's see. I'll say. I bet there's a Pepe on here. I'll leave this Pepe. Yes, I see image six, which means. Somewhere on here is a Pepe. Oh, here he is. Yes, we'll, we'll leave that. We'll leave, we'll leave him just for proof. See? Pepe lives there. All right, so we're going to go over to ZXW, and we are going to look for anything that is VCC main that is still left on this board. Michael Oberdick, I tried getting enough donations last night to make him punt the board live. Um, Oh yeah, when he said he wanted seven hundred dollars in donations. Yeah, the, watching Lewis's donation stream, like he's so funny because he's in New York City. He makes more than the guy with the Elmo suit standing in front of Times Square taking pictures with little kids. Um, I did a, I did what I personally thought was a fantastic stream yesterday, and I made um, I made one dollar in donations. One dollar. And uh, that was only because I made that guy donate $1. So I think that has a lot to do with uh, Lewis's other fun, fun ha 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 troll of uh, Jessa and her, whatever he says, water tower of gold. Um, so uh, you would be, he'll be glad to know that I got denied for a loan today because uh, tax return says that I don't make enough uh, I don't have enough income. So they said, get the fuck out. So that's, uh, you know, that's a, a, a bummer. All right, let's, um, let's match up ZXW with uh, VCC main. So we'll click back over here. Focus, you fuck. Yeah, I, he fucked up the focus and I don't know how to fix it. I don't have a Y chromosome. I can't, I can't help that. Okay, so we're gonna start down here uh, and just sort of compare compare ZXW to this actual board. So we have VCC main on Wi-Fi and these three guys. And if we look over at our board, we have Wi-Fi gone and so are those three guys. All right, so that's a perfect match. So let's go back here. God damn it. All right, and then that's still Wi-Fi chip, which is gone. Let's look over here. Nothing on that side of the board. Let's check just to be sure. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Let's check around here by audio IC. So audio IC is gone, and we need to make sure these two caps and these two caps are gone, plus a cap here, these two caps, and that guy. So let's check our board and see if uh, whoever worked on this also got those guys. Audio IC is gone, the two caps here, the two caps there, the cap here, this cap, and his buddy, and that cap, all already gone. So that has been, that has been cleared, all right? Next, we are missing that chip already, so let's go look down, um, let's move this out of the way. Uh, let's see, so on this side, we need, this guy's gone, and we've got two caps there, Two caps there, Stockholm chip, and a bunch of these caps, one, two, three, four, five, six, plus those two, this guy, the one in the middle, and the one by himself. Let's check and see if any of those are still left on our board. So let's go on a hunt. All right, so we're missing the uh, Oscar chip, and we already have gone those two guys. This entire row is gone. The little dude by himself, the one in the middle, and that guy is also gone. Stockholm is gone, and the two buddies next to it, and the unrelated, not VCC main guy, is gone as well. All right, back to ZXW. So we're getting close. We've got, like, nothing, nothing on VCC main on this entire half of the board. 
All right, so we're, we're, we're going to be narrowing this down. We're going to narrow it down. And now I've got a bunch of Pepe stuff on my chat. Um, Pepe, Pepe, Pepe. No spoilers have not watched that video yet. The one where I made the guy donate a dollar? Well, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a spoiler. He had to donate a dollar for guessing the wrong cap. We'll see if uh, I can force somebody else to guess, guess a cap and have the cap uh, guessing game. All right, so back over here, we have down in the baseband power chip area. Baseband power chip itself, there's sort of every other guy, a little dude by him. This guy up here, this guy here, and then there's some caps that are around, around here, which those still might be on this board, I think. Let's check. Let's move this and go back to the, not the camera, back to the microscope. All right, let's check. Baseband power IC is gone. Oh, here's one of our every other guys. He's still there. Let's just go ahead and get him off the board. Yay, we found something still on VCC main. Hooray. Not for long. Not for long. Let's squash him off. There we go. He tends to stick to the pad. That fucking... Get out of here and your dirty little pad with you. All right, let's see if that made a, any difference. That would be funny if... I mean, it would be funny and incredibly sad if the... You know, if it was... Oh, yeah, you missed one cap. That was the one. Sorry. Sorry, dude. Nope, still short. Okay, so it wasn't him. Didn't look like it was going to be him because he didn't look fucked up at all. That's not good. Solder between those two dudes. There we go. All right. Back over here. Um, so I think it's this, this guy. Maybe that one. I forgot already. And then over here in this area, these guys really look okay. So I'm kind of hesitant to, to kick them off until we... We look for everything to see if something looks bad. That guy's not on VCC main. So I think these two guys, some of these are, and I'm pretty sure that guy. Let's check. Let's check. Let's compare. All right, so on ZXW screen, let's go back. And yeah, so that big guy up there and this guy. So both of them are still there. And then the little party of four. Table for four, right there. It's still there. So brutal watching Jessa knock the caps off. Yeah, it's very, um, it's, uh, it's, it's very barbaric. What can I say? All right, uh, Tigris is gone. Q1403 is gone. The dude next to him is gone. These are all no stuffs, but let's check on that. So we're going to go back and check. <coughs> um, Tigris is gone already. That cap is gone. Q1403 is gone. And those are no stuff. So that doesn't, does not apply. All right. Back to ZXW. Here you go, ZXW. All right. Got to move this again. And there's nothing on that half of the board. So status, this side of the board, we have cleared, we have cleared all of VCC main. Well, all, all we did actually was kick off one cap, but now having kicked off that one cap, all of VCC main is cleared except for, oh my God, somebody, I already learned more today than from Lewis. Yay. <laughs> Thanks, Scotty Two Shoes. You're my, you're my biggest fan. <laughs> so, uh, so now we have just like a few really good looking caps that I honestly, I'd be surprised if they were failures. We'll come back and knock them off if we can't find any other, any other reason. And then we would have to declare that the short is within the board somehow. So let's look at the other side. So let's flip her over and we're going to go back to, um, we're going to go back to, the top side of the board. So let's look for VCC main. We're on the prowl for VCC main. All right. So on the top side of the board, we've got the camera LDO and the cap next to it. And those we saw on our first look are already gone. So let's see. And we have, yep, camera LDO and the dude next, him and the dude next to him <coughs> are gone. And what else? What else? Step right up. Step right up, VCC main candidates. All right, so that kind of takes us over here to just under the CPU shield. A coil has no path to ground. So that's not ground. That's not ground. 
there's no way that this coil itself could become a wire to ground. So he can stay there. He's in the clear. We're going to exonerate him. These two caps are already gone. Backlight driver's gone. Coil, again, no path to ground. So we can exonerate the coils, both of these guys. So we've got chestnut, mesa, a little cap by mesa, and then these two caps are kind of hard to remove. So let's see what, what of all that is still on our board. Let's see. These two are gone, backlight driver's gone. Chestnut's gone, Mesa's, Mesa chip is gone. So we still have these two caps. So we could, again, that just looks really beautiful. So we could come back, maybe this guy, we can kind of think about him. And this guy, this is a VCC main cap as well. All right, who's knocking at the door? I'm afraid that it's, that it's uh, Jean's customer from today. Sharon, did you hear? <laughs> that Jean's shop dog peed on a customer, apparently. <laughs> I did hear that. Yeah, so Jean, what's up with your dog peeing on a customer? Hey, how are you? Oh, there's a customer here. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> Hello. All right, so let's... <laughs> let's... Um, it's Christy, hooray! The internet loves Christy. All right, so Are let's. Are we live streaming? Yeah. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. <laughs> it's okay, I'm cool with live streaming. Oh, great! Then, in which case, yes. And oh, get, guess what, Christy? Was so kind. Guess what I guess what I ordered today? What? I think this is gonna be Sharon. Oh, Sharon, you're Mark gonna love shirt, this. Way cuter than Mark. <laughs> for you to wear on on the stream. Mm -hmm. um, that's a good idea, but no, that's not where I was going. I ordered a green screen. So that, I love this idea. I'm, I want to make like OBS have like a, a green screen and then I want to play a video of like a sweatshop in the background. Won't that be fucking funny? And then we could like do different things like I've had rehab on the moon or you know like mm -hmm. underwater or whatever. I need, some, I need some good ideas. Hey chat, I need, some, I need some good green screen ideas. I, my first idea, the one I really want to do is is like a little clip. Who has a non-copyrighted clip they can send me of uh, like Foxconn assembly line or, or just a sweatshop in Shenzhen or something like that? I think that would be pretty, pretty, pretty good. Um, so I'm super excited about my green screen. Hopefully I can figure it out with having, without having to ask for Y chromosome assistance because I'm not doing that again, fuck that. I should have known, he volunteered. He was like, do you need some help? Sure. Do you need some help setting up your uh, your Streamlabs? Yeah, no, sure, no. buddy. Yeah, that was stupid. Why didn't I see that one coming from a mile away? All right, so down here on this side of the board, let's just see what we're already missing and then kind of match it that way. So we're missing this cap, we're missing that cap, we're missing these two little dudes. Uh, coils are gone, which is kind of weird, and that chip. All right, let's match her up, match it up, match it up. Whoa, not that, right here. Okay, so let's slide on down, ease on down the road. Um, Christine? Christine? Probably. There were a couple things that didn't, there were a couple things on the front counter that I didn't do intake on. Oh, okay. Um, oh, new tweezers are here, so that's good. All right, so those are all gone. Those are gone. I, I think so. These are gone. That's gone. That's gone. Okay, I think there's only one place else left to really check, which is around here. Nope, none of that is VCC main. Okay, so what do you guys think's going on? What should we do? What should we do? We still have we still have a VCC main short. I think so anyway. Let's just make sure. We still have a VCC main short, and we have not much VCC main left. And all of the VCC main that is left is looks really pretty. So you know, if in, in water damage, you're not really expecting electrical failures or drop failures. Those are generally kind of, they don't show any signs of damage. Water damage does. So if there's a, a device with water damage, you're looking for corrosion, something that's going to corrode a cap. That's how it's going to fail. All right, let's see. Replace the iPad rehab logo. Oh, that would be so fucking funny. Let's do this. Let's replace the iPad rehab logo and just put a backdrop of Lewis's shop. That would, be, that would be so funny. 
I like that idea as well. Let's see what other ideas you guys have. Um, let's see. Have Lewis's shop in the background with a sign that says, help me. How about a sign that, that how about we decorate Lewis's shop graphic with a bunch of uh, still with her stuff and then that could be our background. I like it. I like it. I like it. Um, all right, let's see. Lewis's shop in the background. Another vote for that. I like that. And plus, he, there's no way he's ever going to watch this stream, so this is great. Uh, let's see. And act like Lewis. Hmm. Nothing. Just do nothing. That doesn't make any sense. You mean, I've um, had rehab live. You mean stream an empty chair? <laughs> yes, stream an empty chair. <laughs> That's that would be pretty funny. Okay. Um... All right, that's a question about something else. All right, we're, we're iPad Rehab Takeover Rossman Shop. I like it. Feed power through VCC Main and find the heat source. All right, so that's a good idea that we could hook this up and look for some heat. Um, all right, we could do that. That's the, only, that's the only idea that I can see on here. So that's, our, that's a good idea. We'll just see if something heats up. And then maybe that would give us a clue. Um, all right, so let's do it. Let's find a good spot. Let's find a good spot. Well, let's just go here at the end of the board. So let's throw a wire on there and we will inject some voltage and see if now we really don't have anything to go on. So this would be when you do want to use a heat-based Short detection method. Jean, tell me about um, your dog. So, dog, bring your dog to work day. Bring your dog to work day, yes. And so, when Sunday got here today, she was really super excited and ran over to Sunday, and Sunday pet her, and she started tickling. You mean she pissed on her? Yeah. Like on Sunday's leg? No, she didn't actually. Continued to be excited and kept doing it. Like kept doing it. Did you guys laugh? Is that all why? All over the front of the store. Oh, all over the front of the store. Yeah, oh, excellent. <laughs> That's great. If you look, you can still see it right over there. If you get a black light out, it's really obvious. Yeah, there's probably all piss all over. So then probably I don't know an hour later, a customer comes in. Yep. The dog gets excited, goes over to the customer, and she pets her, and she pees on her foot. Okay. She's wearing sandals. Oh, wow. Ouch. Oh, what did the customer say when the shop dog pissed on her foot? Were they new sandals? No, she didn't seem upset. Okay, good. She um, more upset that we didn't want to do anything with her nexus phone, but... You guys didn't make an exception after dog piss? No. I'm, oh, wow, hardcore. <laughs> Get the fuck out and take your pissy foot, too, because, man, this is a, this is a clean sweatshop. So, look what you made my dog do. Look what you made my dog do with your damn Nexus phone. So then anybody, for anybody that came in after that were like, uh, don't touch the dog. <laughs> don't touch the dog. She touch the dog at your own risk. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. Sounds like a shop up the street for me. Uh, Jess, remember VCC... ID? I don't know what that means. Under a few IC chips... <coughs> like Mason, etc. cetera. Are open VCC ID? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, it's quite interesting at a hardware level. I admire their SOC design skills. All right, that sounds like something else. Mm, okay. Uh, well, that'd be really funny. Buy a few parts from a known bad China seller, pretend to be an Apple certified shop, and just bend the parts you get. That would be pretty funny. Okay, so now what we have so far is a wire soldered to what we know is a short uh, VCC main line. And Christine just came in so she gets to hear about Jean's dog story. Dog? Yeah, the shop dog that pisses on customers. <laughs> True story. The shop dog? On, on, on unrelated yeah. news, don't pet Jean's dog. If you're, wearing, if you're wearing sandals, definitely don't. 
Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm just going to attach it to, oh, I'm uh, attaching a wire. I'm going to just do uh, battery voltage because I want to, I don't want to, there's, there's like no caps on this line there, or anything else. <laughs> All right, so we um, can freeze the board down. And then I'll just touch it to ground. But first I have to find some freeze spray. <coughs> I have so for those of us showing up late, what are you working on? <coughs> I am working on data recovery, a board that has practically nothing at all left on VCC main. Oh, there we go. Are those new? Okay, excellent. Great. Okay, I'll do this one. How many are there? Three, four. Three? Four. Okay. All right. So we're going to... Do we have to unclip anything? Okay. So let's freeze this sucker down. And let's let you guys see what the frozen board... The frozen tundra. The frozen tundra of this board looks like. We'll flip it over to the other side. All right, and blow on it to complete the frozen tundra effect. Okay, so there we go, nice and chilly, cold. All right, let's look for heat. So now all I have to do is touch touch a, uh, the, the ground to any, any ground. So I'll pick that one there, and my uh, DC power supply says that I have uh, one and a half amps going through this board. That's a lot. That's enough to make something get hot. So that's a full short to ground. And if there, if something's going to get hot and declare itself, then it will. All right. Let's. I didn't see anything really jump out at me. Let's kind of focus on the bottom half of the board since that looks like it got maybe uh, warm before the rest of the board. All right, focusing here on the bottom half of the board, we're going to reconnect, grab it, and I see my one and a half volts. All right, burn, baby, burn. Show me some heat somewhere. Show me. So with a one and a half amp short, that's strong. That's a strong short. So if something was going to get hot, it would be, it would jump right out at you. And nothing on here is showing me heat. Nope, no hot spot on this side. Let's check the other side. So we'll flip it. And we'll do this one more time. All right, so we're getting the whole board nice and cold. All right. Frozen tundra. And I'm trying not to touch it with my fingers. All right, I'm connected. I see my one and a half amps. And looking around. Hot spot, show yourself. Hot spot, hot spot. Hot spot, anybody hot? Anybody hot? So again, like by now, something, if it's gonna get hot, it's just gonna, it's gonna jump out at you. It's a, that's a strong short, that's a lot of current. Remember that on a normally booting I, iPhone, you'll, you won't ever even see one and a half amps. All right, so we're gonna disconnect. And result. Heat did not declare itself on this board. So we um, can't use heat to, to tell us anything. What up, Sunday? Did I tell you about my uh, green screen idea? Green screen? Yeah, so I need green screen ideas. So I ordered a green screen. And I think it would be really funny to do um, like a sweatshop. You know, that would be pretty cool. I don't know, back there. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have chats. We're gonna 
we're going to talk about. So, uh, how is it by any chance like a retractable green screen? Retractable? Like a projector? Yeah, like a projector screen. No, no. it's just like a sheet. I found a big projector screen at the apartment somewhere like a real legit like pull down. Can we paint it green? Probably. Awesome. All right. Well, we'll see if Don't that. Don't we already have a green screen? What? Do we? How do we already have a green screen? You probably do. Oh, no. I just thought you had a green screen because your Christmas picture looked like it was Photoshop. All right. PM, a VCC ID equals IS. I don't know what that means. Help me out on that. We're looking at VCC underscore main, so I'm not sure what else that would be. Must be a short under one of the IC chip. Put some juice on the board and check for heat. What IC chip? There's like not, there are literally zero IC chips on VCC main left on the board. Uh, so let's see. Puppy name Pepe? Nope. Power IC caps are VCC main. Are those off? Yes. So we just did a whole big tour of the board. There is, there is nothing on VCC main at all except for like two or three beautiful looking caps. There were zero chips, no Wi-Fi chip, no PMIC, no Q1403, no Tigris, no Chestnut, no Mesa, no Audio IC, no Stockholm, no uh, Oscar IC. None of those. All of those are not on the board anymore. This is getting to be basically a bare board. So on VCC main, the, there's like board and there's like three caps. And those caps did not heat up. VCC main does what exactly? VCC main is the artery. It's the main power. It's the giant extension cord that uh, plugs into the power management chip that then gets divided up into all of the uh, tiny little voltages that go all over the board. Kennel with bladder, problematic dog. That would be really funny. Yes. Yeah, we just talked about that. What are your thoughts on using stone tile under an iPhone logic board when using hot air? Uh, fine. Have at it. What are we doing? We are going to um, bitter agent can of air. No, I'm using freeze spray. I like literally use freeze spray. What brand of cold air? Freeze spray. Oh, it's called super cold. All right. Um, solder the wire to the ground side of the cap pads. What? That doesn't make any sense. Uh, live board repair from Nebraska for a green screen idea. I like that idea. That would be really funny. Like while the like the the uh, opponents are testifying, like the magnetron lady could be like kind of doing her thing and would be like yeah. fixing stuff. That would be. I like that. I like that. Sweatshirt. Oh, mm. all right. Let's see. So, what does VCC main do? It is, um, Jessa. It was a typo. He meant is not ID. Well, if you're if the if the original comment there was check for VCC main under Mason, it doesn't go under Mason. It doesn't go under Cumulus. So that's why I don't really get what he's talking about. All right, just started watching Jessa. Awesome. I'd still take those three caps off, says Leslie. Um, you'd really want to replace those, however. Without them, the system would go crazy due to lack of decoupling. Jessa is Q1403. Oh, no. Oh. It's, oh. You're killing me. What's that it, I just did an entire... <coughs> I did an entire... 15 minute block yesterday. You're that you have homework. Fixing things for you, you have homework to go watch yesterday's stream and come back and tell me why it can't possibly be Q1403. Besides the fact that it's gone off the board, why Q1403 is not gonna be. All right, let's go ahead. Jessa, I am speaking Chinglish. Okay, good. So you're kidding. Yay! All right, I get trolled constantly. I have stopped, I have uh, still failed to learn, learn how to expect it. All right, so let's kind of clean this off a little bit. I'm gonna get some toothbrush and alcohol, and we are going, my next step is, there's just so much damage on this board. So if you do the kind of quick and dirty method like I totally do when I'm trying to fix a board quickly, for data, when it's, you know, water damage board, it's not, really a candidate to be a board again. Um, too much corrosion all over the place, trying to get data. Then I do just knock caps off the board. That is the fastest way to solving the problem. And remember, this is a business. So this is about 
you know, you can't really be a hobbyist. If you were a hobbyist, then you could take your time and, you know, replace caps as you found out that they were not shorted. But as a business, you can't. You have to kind of keep up uh, a more systematic approach. And if you can't find an answer in a reasonable amount of time, then you have to keep it as a pet and work on it for three or four days, Lewis Rossman, or you can, um, you have to give up and move on to all of, you can't make all those customers wait um, while you spend too much time on one board. Jean is a particular expert at that, so she never goes down the rabbit hole. So we try to kind of think in our heads, what would Jean do? Jean, what is your, what is your, tell us your secret, because I think, honestly, I think a lot of technicians are drawn to this field for the love of solving the problem, and it's really hard to say, ah, eh, fuck it, uh, especially if you put time into it. Huh? I like that theory, ah, uh, fuck it. Ah, that's, fuck it. That's my... That's your, you just, you're, you've got a low threshold for, ah, eh, fuck this board. My, I my shirt. Your shirt? Ah, fuck it. Yeah, we're going to say on the front, what would Jean do? WWJD, and on the back, ah, yeah, eh, fuck it. Oh yeah, sorority sorority pled shirts. Were you in a sorority, Christy? No. Christy? Were you? Yeah, Christy, don't lie. Come on. Sharon, were you in a sorority? Wait, oh my god, what? Were you in a sorority? No. You were a sorority cheer. Do it. Yes, exactly. You had a cheer, didn't you? No. Liar. You had a cheer. What is it? Just like what's one line of the theme song? Oh, so you were in a sorority. It was 112 years ago. Oh, that doesn't sorority. matter. What sorority was it? Um, I want your iPad research to say sorority girl. Yeah, you know what? This was 112 years ago. Do you remember the name of the house? The name of the sorority? Uh -uh. Yes, you do. No, you don't forget that shit. That shit's... Show me your arms. It's branded into you. I'm sure of it is. Like for hazing and stuff like that. Uh, I was in a sorority. Were you? Yeah, man. I mean, I'm still in a sorority because that shit's for life. <laughs> yeah, I can sing you some theme songs right now. Okay, go ahead. Um, the the actually the 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 Delta Gamma kind of theme song is really not. It's really like uncool. Like it's horrifying. It's, it's, it's Delta Gamma Sorority University of Maryland, A, is the one that was, that was on this, uh, that whole, like, they did a whole Saturday Night Live thing about it, where it was about the, the chick that did that letter, and David Shannon read it, you know, about, like, you know, you, will, I will cunt pun a bitch that doesn't show up for, uh, you know, whatever with Sigma Nu at Greek Week. That was my actual sorority house. But the theme song for, uh, for the GG House, the University of Maryland, one of them was called Rugged But Right. I just came down to tell you that I'm rugged but right. The Delta Gamma sisters who are singing tonight. Ho, 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 hoping that you'll love us just as we all love you. We're so glad we're anchored to the bronze, pink, and blue. Rugged but right. That means we're fucking ugly bitches, but you know, d <laughs> rugged but right, that is not okay. And that's like not even what this house was known for. I can see why they got in trouble on Saturday Night Live. All right, let's fix this board. Lewis needs to know how Pepe is doing. Tell him I didn't delete one of them because I'm nice. Super nice. Because I'm a DG girl and DG girls are nice. That's what they're known for. Okay. Um, so let's go to... More, how, how is Pepe doing? Pe Pepe is fine. Pepe is fine. Who is Pepe? Uh, you're going to have to look that shit up. <laughs> All right. Let's take a real close look for what I would do next, which is, is there any sign of a mechanical bridge to ground? So with all this, this amount of knocking off of caps, oh, somebody, so, hey, fixing things for you. My wife finds it funny I spend more time with you than her. Is she a Delta Gamma sorority sister? In which case, it's totally, totally fine. Um, Lewis says he missed you. I don't think so. Is he still working on that rabbit hole? His pet? Is he, tell him that he needs to, he's fed his pet for the day, and now he needs to let his pet sleep. That's just, that's the only way. You have to treat your pet right, or else he'll start pissing on your foot. That board's going to start pissing on his foot. You need to go warn him that that's what's getting ready to happen. 
Well, thank you, Fixing Things, for you. Um, why does Lewis get over a thousand viewers? Uh, because of his Lewis charisma. I don't. I don't know. We we have like ten viewers. <laughs> that's all. That's all we can do. Okay. So um, we are going to look for mechanical damage, like any. If you knock something off and the and the pad touched ground or something like that, then that could cause that as well. So let's go ahead and the pet is working. Yay, good for him. I knew he would fix that. That, that board was eventually going to get fixed. You could tell. Um, microscope. All right, now we're going to go super sharp-eyed, razor-eyed vision. And we're going to find a problem. All right, so we'll look around here. So we're looking like right here. See, that is all okay. It's not bridged to ground in any way. That's torn off, but it's okay. So fine. Uh, I forget which one is VCC main on this one. But that doesn't look like it's touching anything. And in here, like let's kind of clear this out a little bit. Because the VCC main side is here. So you can read the board. You can see that border. So as long as these guys are on this side and not touching anybody else, we could even fold this guy up. Here you go, buddy. Stay out of trouble. Don't touch any ground. It'll give you, it'll give you AIDS. All right. That is not touching anything on the ground. This guy is not in his right spot, but that's okay. Nobody's bothering anybody here. That's all fine. That's fine. All right, continuing the hunt. All right, over here. This is the side that's VCC main. And let's just look. Is there anybody touching ground that we can see? And... Let's just check under here. All right, that's okay. See, like this one's ground. This is kind of what we're looking for on a VCC main line. See how this one has a little dingleberry sticking off? All right, so that's fine. That looks okay. That looks okay. All right, over here. That looks okay. That's the VCC main side. It's not touching anybody but VCC main. That's not touching anybody. That ball's not touching anybody. Up here, let's look. All right. Mm, that one I don't like the look of, so I'm going to just make this one have puffy pillows. Let's just get this one to have puffy pillows and we'll see if we can clear it. Let's see. Now I'm happy with how that looks. Yeah, hell if, what the hell is all this like? Antac never turns into tar. Hell if it doesn't, look at that. That looks like a total fruit fly shit. All right, let's get a closer eye on that spot. All righty. Poor Lewis did all that hard work making Pepe Trolls, and he didn't even get to see the start of my stream. And the whole, let's not stream at the same time, was a fucking troll today, which struck me as really weird at the time. Like, why do you care all of a sudden? I just don't like to stream against you. Mm -hmm. What you really mean is... I want. I don't want to be in the middle of a stream when you turn on o Open Broadcaster and don't notice that I put Pepe all over it. That's what he meant by that. Okay, so that now it doesn't look like it's touching anybody, and let's go ahead and see if that makes a difference. All right. Freshly squeezed Lewis Rossman Amtech. All right, so wake up the multimeter. And we still have VCC main short, so it wasn't him. All right, but that looks a lot, a lot better. This looks 
actually fine because that's you can read the board that's the ground side so that doesn't matter that's not touching anybody that guy's fine that guy's fine fine seems okay that seems okay that side's gone that side goes to ground that is definitely not okay in this old area that is not okay let's get rid of that little ejaculate nice little dollop all right let's clear that up let's kind of oh yeah that was this is vcc main right here that's vcc main that's ground that's ground you can tell by the amount of heat it takes to heat it up yeah that's vcc main look you can read the board that was definitely vcc main touching ground right there oh yeah here we go so you can read the board vcc main and it goes into this whole strip of pads and then it comes over here to this cap so we have ground cap side of vcc main ground and then this vcc main they're together and those guys were talking to each other all right let's see if that was it let's see if that was it so we'll go back and measure at our spot let's see <coughs> all right this is ground and for the money <gasps> yay it's quiet hooray <coughs> hooray yay so we found the vcc main short and it was mechanical just from all of that kind of dig uppery um which is really not surprising that probably well, that was probably the like one of the early things that whoever worked on this removed but then just smudged together the pads and then everything after that that's brutal so don't make that mistake and now we rebuild. So let's see what we need to get back on here. So I'm gonna start with, a. am gonna stick the couple of chips. We'll stick on Tigris. What else is required? Chestnut and the power management chip. So we're gonna start with the little chips to sort of warm up the board instead of uh, trying to throw the power management chip on there on a cold board. All right, let's see. iPad rehab, wasn't that using your flick method? Yeah, which I totally stand by. Love the flick method. <clears throat> like when I tried to unscrew with a penelope screw driver, it wouldn't work. Hmm. Uh, don't ever leave us. I'm in Ireland. It's 2 a.m. and I'm up for work in three hours. Well, um, hmm. Let's see. Poor guy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I really hope whoever is not. This one would be, I don't know about my whole like YouTube live experience, which I love that idea. I think it'd be a lot, a lot of fun. Um, but this one would be really painful to watch because you would send it in thinking like, oh, it's going to be a short in the board and, and uh, Jess is going to have to like dig down and find it and like get rid of it. And it'll be like, oh, no, Deep. You, you accidentally smashed a, smashed a, uh, a pad into ground plane. All right. How much do you have to rebuild to get, to get data off? So Mason and Chestnut. Mason's still there because Mason doesn't have a VCC main connection. What was the history of the phone? It was water damaged. And then it went to somebody who was very very passionate about finding a vcc main short and almost found it but not quite all right did you get your scope back yet uh we we it the guy says he's sending it back so um yeah it'll be here tomorrow it'll be here tomorrow awesome all right so then we'll have to get back on that iphone 7 home button project okay um do you repair vending machine control boards I have 30 that need new chips. I have the chips too. Uh, yeah, totally. Didn't we do one of those? Pretty sure. Yeah, that's way, that's super up our alley. We do, we we do a lot of these sort of you know systematic problems, you know drones or um, some you know soldering, making custom cables, you know th anything that requires use of micro soldering equipment. A uh, guy, local guy, fixes BMW light strips that go out. So yeah, we're always um, we're always open for those kind of jobs. You can contact us at the iPad Rehab website and submit a quote request and just kind of pick something unusual. You know, I think there's a something weird category and you can 
uh, tell us about your project. Okay. Yeah, we did like a school, you know, making boards for some kind of school one time. So let's start with Tigris. So we'll put back Tigris. Let's check on these pads. All right. We will put some flux down there. I really can't stand that flux. And let's get, let's see if there's still a Tigris left in this strip. All right, and we'll click over to microscope view. There we go. Microscope view. We're going to make this board work, although I don't know. This one, the, 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 it has had so, so much heat from someone I don't know to get the chips off that I don't know if anything got overheated. So this may all be a giant waste of time and it could have a dead CPU, we don't know. There's only one way to find out. And again, that sort of points to the whole like, you know, kick off cap method. If this board has a dead CPU, there's no path to data. I wanna to get to that as fast as possible rather than like painstakingly, you know, caring about each one of these caps. I mean, this, is, this phone is clearly never going to be a phone again. So we're just trying to get their data. baby all right so that's tacked down so now I want it to really find its own way I don't want to tell it where to go find your way home little tigress find your way there you go buddy yeah see I didn't want to tell you that wasn't your right spot all right, so Tigris is back on. Now let's heat up the board. Actually, we're gonna have to do a little work here. We need to, we can't, we have a separation of battery and VCC main right now. Let's go back to this. And we need to wrap this up because it looks like it's time for team meeting super stat. So let's throw these chips back on and see what happens. All right, so I'm just gonna rain down a unlimited supply of jumpers, a lifetime supply. There we go. And I'm gonna pick one and blow the rest away. All right, we'll have to move to a different spot just to make sure that we don't get those in there. All right, so we're gonna stick on, we're just gonna make a manual connection between VCC main and uh, battery VCC rather than put back on a chip. No passcode, no care. But, but I don't know if it's actually been, was there any issues? There's no update at all. What device are you talking about? Um, I repair Canal, Jeremy Fellish. Wait, is this Jeremy Fellish? I just fixed something for him the other day. Yeah, you gave it to Sharon to reassemble, but you never updated that. So I, did I do it or Mark did it? That sounds I, like something I Mark would do. I think it was, there should have been a Mark. Yeah, that's definitely going to be Mark. Four, Mark's the only one that does that. Okay. I, I wouldn't so do that. So I would, I can't test it to see if it's working or not. What's wrong it with it? It was here for no power and it powers on, so just okay, done. send it back. Yeah, man. Or, I mean, you can just tell him no further testing was done. You didn't give the password to douchebag. Okay. No uh, Jeremy Fellish, if you are watching the stream, you speak you now with the, pa enter your customer's passcode right now into chat and you'll get testing. Otherwise, you didn't follow instructions. You can also go to your ticket and update it. Or you there. could update Just your ticket. Tell us that you updated the ticket in chat. Yeah, exactly. I, know, I, think you, I think you should be required to... Yeah, what she said. What she said. Okay. All right. So now we have battery VCC and VCC main connected. And let's just kind of make sure, make sure of that. Pretty sure that those pads go like that. But let's just pick. All right. So this is... Which one? The one you just gave me? The touch? Yeah. All right, that side's ground, so this side's 
uh, battery connector. So I'm in the battery connector. Let's just make sure that talks to VCC main. It does. All right. This is not going to be any kind of four hour. I am almost done. I have two chips to put back on and test. All right. All right. You can uh, call up Mark if you want to have him be participating in this. Are you done with Almost. I have two chips to put back on. Okay. All right. So now we're going to put back on chestnut. Chestnut. Chestnut roasting on a shorted out board. All right. There's a chestnut. All right. Upgrading from 16 to 128 gigabytes of data. Same idea, you need to restore to regain functionality on the new board. Yes, you do. Or dog piss. Did Nathaniel play with Jean's dog today? Because I have another theory on what it could be, why his shirt was wet. No, it's my shirt. Okay. All right, I need to put a heat sink on my CPU. Where's my heat sinks? Where are my heat sinks? I thought I had a giant stack of quarters like one minute ago. Where'd they go? How is that possible that my thousands of quarters are ran off? I've been robbed. Oh, here's one. Okay, heat sink. And let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll this chestnut right on here. Okay, chestnut is on, and now we need to, let's make sure that we don't have, uh, I don't, I really don't like how that cat is sitting. I'm going to have to nudge him. He is too close. Too close for comfort. On the border, but it's just a little bit too close for me. You think it feels like a sweatshop when everybody's here at once? Okay. That's better. All right. Anybody else that we need for data? Let's see. Hmm. Mm hmm. I don't think so. No wires from my wire parade here. Nope. Nope. Let's get rid of that. Okay. So now the last guy is going to be the power management chip. First, we're going to check to make sure we have not grown back a VCC main short. Before we stick on PMIC, so let's just make sure that's not happening. All right, that looks good. And I want to check to, because I don't know how much heat, because the PMIC came off. It was off. 
all these chips are off. So I don't know how much heat the CPU saw. So it could be all blobbed under there and we're just wasting our time. Um, especially because I see some signs of heat right here. So that's not good. But let's find out. So we're going to do some measurements here. So that's a little bit low. That's normal. That's normal. And that's normal. This is warm now, so it, it looks like it's coming up, so I'm going to say uh, still still worth a shot. Still could come back in into the realm of normal. All right, let's look at these pads real close. All right, so first I'm just going to kind of tin over and get these pads themselves puffy pillowed so that they can make good connections. So I'm going to get some solder and kind of condition this tip a little bit and an iPhone dead on the floor what <laughs> resistance is futile My back was broken and I went to physical therapy today and it was awesome. Really? Yeah, you should, everyone should go. I mean, it was amazing. You can't just go to physical therapy. What do you mean? Well, it was kind of like that because they're like, who is your referring physician? Dr. Jones. <laughs> they're like, no, seriously. I'm like, yeah, I just walked in here because Adrian said you guys were awesome. And they're like, okay. Huh? Did you go to the Lattimore? Yeah. Made an appointment and went once and yeah. then started going, you know, but you pay 25 bucks as copay, so it's kind of expensive to work out. Wait, you were going to work out? Yeah. What? I would just go work, we use the elliptical and then. Were you actually getting physical therapy? Well, he told me that's all physical therapy is, is do the exercise. I thought it was great because they, they like, he, you know, kind of did all these range of motion things and he could you know, kind of like identify like, yeah, this side, you have like 15 degrees less mobility than the other side, blah, blah. But the biggest thing that he told me, like I did a squat with this wooden dowel over my head, which is kind of weird. And then I, I noticed that like my feet, like came, my heels came up and I was like, huh, that's weird. And he's like, yeah, you got to keep your heels down. And when I did it, keeping my heels down, it was like total pain. That, like that was what was causing back pain. And so he's like, he's like, yeah, so, you know, it's ankle mobility. What? Ankle mobility causing back pain. Who knew? All right, that looks great. So we are going to go ahead and <coughs> get a new power management chip on there. <coughs> Scotty Two Shoes says physical therapy is awesome. I had to do it for about two years. Well, it seems pretty awesome because I my back felt better after I left there than it has for weeks. Plus, the guy said that I massage. Yeah, I am all about that as well. Well, I sent Pam like sent me a thing, so she's like, "When's a good time?" And I'm like, "Well, I'm in Walt Disney World, so not today." All right, let's find. Yeah, she better hurry up because I gotta teach next week and the week after. It's hard during course That's week. Yeah, totally good idea. All right, let's look at this before we actually put it on and make sure it's not horrible. Hey, thanks for coming in. Who was that? Somebody that plays Wait, somebody that you know but don't really? Was she in your sorority? Are you guys sorority sisters? Yeah, we must be. Okay. All right. This, I don't think, is the right PMIC. Yeah, it's not the right PMIC. God damn it, Mark, what have you done with my PMICs? All right. Oh, uh, that's a 5S one. I should have known. 
This is all crepe right now. God damn it. All right, let's see. Are you the sixes? I'm pretty sure, 1251. But I wanna check a donor board to make sure that we are not gonna put on some other phones, PMIC, because that would be totally uncool. All right, donor, 338S1251. Okay, and the dot, pretty sure it goes at that bottom corner, and it does. Okay, so now we are coming down the home stretch on this board. What did Sharon do? Oh, for disassembly? Yeah. And you thought they were done? Yeah. I'm like, sweet. Hey, look, there's no more touch jobs left. Oh, Sharon's just taking them apart. Damn you, Sharon. God damn it. If you want to take them apart, you can. Sharon, I was writing your, your bio for the new website. Yeah, how'd they I go? called I upgraded you from screw bitch to screw guru. Wow. I thought that sounded a little a little more profesh. Wow. But that she wasn't a sorority Oh my god, that's what we need to do. Like instead of like having little social media links. I'm guessing that you guys don't really want your social media links to actually go to your social media. So we could just put like sorority uh, letters. Sure. <laughs> Sunday, were you in a sorority? No. no. I was in a sorority. Do I seem like I could be in a sorority? Sharon was in a sorority. Um, yeah, me and Sharon are the sorority girls. And I'm sure Christine was in a sorority. There's no way that Christine was not. slightly well better behaved than I was at a very many. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, let's hear your sorority song. They can't hear you all the way over there. Just say a line of it. Come on. Oh, God bless it. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Jesus, Christine. Oh, my God. You sang that? You sang that? Yeah, she and just sang. All I hear is Christine, some, some, some defy. We'd rather fuck than fight. Wow. Wow. Sharon, now I really want to know what your sorority song was. Yeah, what's the next line? Sing the other stanza. She has to take it. Jesus yeah. Christ, to hell with morals, to hell with values? Yeah. And I bet it went in if you're not a DeFi, you then fuck you. Yeah. What? Wow. It is, yeah, we had DeFi. Those, those girls were bitches. <laughs> we were the nice girls that had, that had sweet little songs like Rugged But Right. We didn't have anything about fucking all night, I'll tell you that. <laughs> we just can oh yeah there part of that song went um god how did it go uh something about oh i don't know something about a v8 yeah. all right yeah we'd rather fuck than fight all right, so now I know what Christine's iPad rehab t-shirt is going to say. I really wasn't expecting that. I was expecting something that might have the word hell in it. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, one of the lines in one of the songs I remember saying, like, and if you, like, about pledging, it was like, you know, if if you see a sister, uh, God, I, all these songs. Is it like Animal House? <laughs> 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 like Animal House. Rather fuck than fight. Damn. 
Christine, sweet Christine, gentle Christine. Yeah. Is ordering receipt printer paper. <laughs> Great, because we're out. <laughs> so it happens. You really, really need it. Right in the second. You feel good? There we go. I tried to get Mark to go pick up a... Oh, shit. None of that was on there. Ah, I tried to go get Mark to pick up a, a package. And he drove all the way to Henrietta with my license. And they didn't think he was me, so they declined him. Can you believe that? Yeah, I can't believe that all of that was not on uh, microscope. Sorry about that, guys. I wanted to see the PMIC get reflowed. Mm, sorry. That, that was, you know... Yeah, I... I wanted to show you. I didn't notice that it was not on microscope view. I was too busy being horrified by Christine's sorority song. <laughs> Christine is a great yeah. contemporary composer. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see. Let's, who's Christine? See, now they want to see her. Yes. Mm -hmm. Walk on by, Christine. Watch the internet go crazy, batshit crazy, when they get a, get a load of Christine. Yeah, where is Christine? She's, she's hiding. Did she leave? Did she actually cross by, or did she crawl? Did she crawl? Did she crawl? Crawl of shame. The crawl of shame. Yeah, that would be really funny, because now it's sitting here on the view of the PMIC. Oh, I wanted to see Christine. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad. Let's be quiet. She'll come back. <laughs> I know you relax. So. There she is. <laughs> All right. Is it true that the TriStar 1610A3 for the iPhone 6S is backwards compatible to the iPhone 5? No, it is not. That is not true at all. Hi, Lewis. Uh oh. Is, oh, God. Was Lewis here uh, to hear your sorority song? <laughs> Oh, oh dear. I hope not. Oh, my God. Oh, my. All right. So we, we have to let this cool, cool down, and then we'll check our, we'll, we'll check our uh, resistance ground before we put power through it, because if the PMIC is misplaced, then you can kill a board. You can kill a CPU <coughs> by sending VCC main. As we learned on the other stream, if you send that up into the CPU, that is curtains. All right. Let's see. Is there is a jumper wire next to HHD? Take a look again. HHD. Mean you mean NAND? This dude? Poo. There you go. Done. All right. Download straight up schematic PDFs. What about pads? Is it cool? I've never used pads. Lewis Rossman, when are you going to upgrade to automatic butt and boob tracking for your streams? Hmm, nice. Sweet Christine, yes. Stop, drop, and crawl. <laughs> Making 50 times more jumper wires than you need than blowing them away wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Maybe not, but it's pretty fun. Oh, we got some more Christine. Show yourself. Yes. All right. I know, exactly. Uh, Lewis, help me with some, we got to delete some shit. I can't have that. All right, so let's check our voltages. <laughs> yeah, this would be like, um, what if there's a donation that's like $100 to see Christine take off her shirt? <laughs> I was just thinking, if I would pay $100 to see Christine just hear that and go, oh. <laughs> All right, let's go to diode mode. All right.
Oh wait, some a student asked you to watch him do his work. Yeah. Oh yeah, he was. Very nice. Yeah, super nice oh, guy. He's like standing here for 20 minutes watching and watching and oh, he's watching you do your work. Yeah, well, he's yeah. trying to learn repair shopper because he just signed well, up. He probably was looking down your shirt. So showing your tits on live stream is out if letting a student watch you use repair shopper is also out. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. Long gone are the would rather fuck than fight days, I guess. <laughs> All right, so I'm checking uh, VCC main in diode mode, and it's 0.359, which is normal. So thumbs up. We don't have a short on VCC main from misplaced power management chip. Now let's go back and check those. Um, yeah, Christine was uh, Christy was talking about ejaculate, and then we, and then Zach called, so we put him on live stream. Yay, that's back up to 139. Yay. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Yay, that's normal as well. All right, so we have hope. And now it is time for us to have our team meeting. So therefore, test. Let's test. Let's test. What do you think is going to happen to this old thing? So right now, it has a power management chip. It has chestnut. It has tigris. And pretty much nothing else. No Wi-Fi, no Mesa chip, no baseband uh, power management chip, uh, no audio IC, no uh, Stockholm chip, no Oscar chip, and practically no caps, except for there's a few. We left a few on there. Let's see. OK, the moment that we have all been waiting for, our giant failure after all that. So let's go ahead and fail and get the hell out of here. All right, so I'm putting on, I really wish I had a camera on here. So I'm going to do doc. Should we be hopeful? Should we go, should we go all the way for, for doc, battery, and screen? We're not going to have a backlight, but we can look for image. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's go big or go home. Let's see. What's going to happen to this, this board? Can a board boot with that much damage and practically nothing on VCC main? All right, I'm going to check my battery voltage first. I don't want to try to ask it to do anything hard, like charge a battery. All right, 3.8.31. All right, let's see. All right, ready to go. We're going to prompt a boot. Let's do it. Let's do this. Prompt to boot with this shows nothing, which is not surprising, I guess. I don't see an image. So let's go look on DC power supply and see if it's actually doing anything at all. Let's see. Let's see. All right, so we'll, we'll try to prompt to boot also from the power button because I'm not, I really don't know if we still have a path from the dock to where it needs to go. All right, on DC power supply, there's no short because it's at zero, so it's at zero <coughs> current, which is normal. Let's prompt to boot. We'll go ahead and try it with USB to see if it actually detects USB. So prompt to boot with USB, connect, and pull it out. And what I see on DC power is flicker, 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 which is what we now know is an I2C clock line down somewhere. So I2C clock line is the next problem on this board. So we can go on a hunt. It could also be the crystal. So there's something wrong. There's a clock signal problem on this board. So 
Um, let's, uh, let me just see if there's a different result at all when I prompt with the power button, but I doubt it. We'll just kind of rule that out. So prompt with power button, and it's the same. So flicker, 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 which is, could be dead CPU, but what it, what it typically would mean that is solvable would be some kind of a clock data line problem. So we'll go on a hunt for that. So this one is on its way to becoming a pet. Not quite though, that wasn't, that wasn't terrible. So we solved the VCC main short, and we have VCC main voltage uh, going, going through this board. So um, there's a chance that PMIC placement isn't all the way down on every, on every ball. It doesn't, it's not shorted anywhere. But there's a possibility that we're not getting all of our voltages, so that would be something that we would want to check to see the, to test PMIC function since it has come off and a new one has gone on. Um, but most, mostly I would want to look in the, it, there was so much of the board was really, really corroded. I would want to look around for uh, data lines, especially clock lines that just had, and this would be very easy to happen on this board, that just were, you know, lifted, that, that weren't making good connections. So that would be the next project for this board. Right now, it, I wouldn't give up hope, but it's definitely, um, now that we've fed and watered it for the day, this board needs to take a nap. It needs to go to sleep. You have to take care of your pets if you want to solve them. So let's check on chat, and then we will, and then we will be done. All right, let's see. Um, let's see. And then we've got to do our meeting, because we're an hour late on that. Damn. Um, what, what are you guys talking about? Where's, where's back all the way up to uh, Christine stuff? <laughs> hmm, let's see. I see a lot of stuff about, somebody's talking about touch I see. Jessa, what instruments do you use? What instruments do you use? I play the flute, um, haven't played it for a long time. Dean plays the clarinet. Sharon, do you play an instrument? Really? You don't play an instrument, but you're in a sorority? I, I had you pegged, like, way wrong. I know. Sunday, do you play an instrument? No. No? Sunday Christine? <laughs> I knew that was coming out. No. Yeah, the male, she plays the male flute. Oh my Christine, God. you weren't in band? Oh, I played the trumpet. Well, that's an instrument, oh, yeah. Oh, Let's make an iPad rehab yeah. band. <laughs> we should do that. Three. I am not going to play cello. Yeah, you play the cello. We could to cello, trumpet, flute, and clarinet. This I is. Will pull a wagon with you can and play the drums. How hard can it be? Bang I them drums. Wait, you guys both took African drum and dance. Yeah. Awesome. Well, I know a lot of little video clips that are going to go on the green screen. <laughs> That's one of them. <laughs> what the hell? Are you alive, Jean? All right, let's get done with this. Need an on-screen digital multimeter. Mm, I, that is for people that like to spend money, unlike me. They buy silly toys. He need replace any chip. Hmm, coils and caps. Hmm. Live, I've had rehab live repair from Christian Sorority. Another green screen idea from Christian Sorority. <laughs> I think we should live, screen, live stream green screen in front of the DeFi e-house at, at Brockport. <laughs> I'll bet you get, mm, that's not cool. So who's not deleting any kind of, any kind of uh, comments here? I think you need an on-screen display for your overlay, I guess so. All right. It's going to boot into Windows 95. <laughs> mm, it's going to work. Let's see. Fan spin on iPhone. Kind of. Uh, where is the business out of? A, a shop. A sweatshop. A beautiful sweatshop in downtown Hawaii Falls. All right. Whoa. This, this chat it's, needs a little get tamed down. All right. Let's see. Jeez. All right, so you're telling me that um, HDMI ports need their own separate estimates saying 
if you send it in, not just yeah, you got to be real clear with that board only I mean, stuff. It says board only board must be removed. It has asterisks around it, but obviously that's not enough. Or just say or uh, or else and then or specify. Can yeah. I just say or else? Just say or else. That's fine. <laughs> that's right. You can put a note in the estimate that board sent in. What amp draw is it flickering? It's the exact same exact same presentation as the as the I2C clock line board from the other day. Jessa, bro, I just stopped in to ask you to challenge Lewis to a game of Texas Hold'em and stream it. I bet it would be a big hit. I bet that it would be super easy because one of us knows how to play Texas Hold'em. And it's not Lewis. All right. I squared C problem, damn it. Uh, I, I'll say that maybe once a week and that was it. So we're done with that. All right. And I got so drunk that I obviously did a Okay. Did you get your oscilloscope back yet? Nope. I think it's on the way soon. Oh yeah, maybe tomorrow. Tuba. Skin flute. Chat is flying by. Say drumming is easy again. I dare you to. Not like real drumming. I mean like. Banging on something to be a part of the iPad rehab band so you're not left out. <clears throat> of of all the instruments so that you're not left out of the iPad rehab band, mm -hmm. you know, okay. just kind of uh, play, pl playing the table. Yeah, the, the, not me, obviously, but, uh, but Rodrigo here doesn't think that you can play the drums. Not even... <laughs> Do you even have an African drum? I have a Gemma top, thank you very much. Oh, well. I think it's called that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to check my notes from yeah. school. It's carved from a tree drum goat skin on top. That's what I remember. Wow. Poor goat. All right. There's a big difference between percussionist and drummer. One is a drummer, the other is a dumber. All right. What? Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, the ZXW has what, there's not really good schematics for Galaxy phones, but what there is, they, they, they actually, they don't know they have schematics, they have a board view. You guys use extractors? Yes. Uh, I have been sick, so I'm still getting over cold. All right, more Pepe, hmm. Let's, we're almost at the end. This, this Jessa more money, Lewis more viewers. Lewis more money, Lewis more viewers. That's that's how you do the math on that. All right. Stretched foreskins drum. Can somebody play the triangle? Uh, I'll have to ask a percussionist um, since that is part of the percussion section. Hmm. More cowbell. How about the sand blocks? Can you play the sand blocks? I2C, inter-integrated circuit, pronounced I2C, is a multi-master, multi-slave packet switched, single-ended serial computer bus invented by Philips Semiconductor, now an XP. That's good. I'm glad to learn that about I2C. All right. Yay! We're at the end. Card game sucks. So Lewis has declined the Texas uh, Hold'em challenge. What I want to challenge Lewis to, which he uh, says he'll do one day but never gets around to it, is the battle to see who can get banned from Apple Support Community Forum. I think that's a really good idea. I think it'd be fun to make some rules that were, you have to, you can look at the questions ahead of time. That, that, would, that would have to happen in order to make it make sense. But then, you know, he answers MacBook questions and I'll answer phone questions or whatever. And you provide legitimate, bona fide, real answers that could actually solve someone's problem and see how long it takes for one or the other of us to actually get banned off the forum just for answering questions with bona fide, legitimate, supported answers that are tried and tested. All right, so um, let me know when you find the I2C problem. Yep, so we'll, we'll come back to this board. It had, all pets have to, they, you can only work on them for so long before you need to um, let them go to sleep and get a little nap. Otherwise, they'll turn into Jean's puppy and start pissing on your shoe. And we don't want that to happen. All right, so we're going to be done with stream. 
and I will see you guys next time.